Hey guys, for today's video blog, I just want to let you know, we, today we were on the Sea Wolf. It's the 24th of September, Sunday, and we had a great day fishing on the rockfish. The link hide, you really had to work at them. I lost four good ones. I had them up about quarter way, halfway, and they came off. Like my hooks turned into rubber and I just lost them, but that's fishing. It was a postcard day today here aboard the Sea Wolf. We got the Golden Gate Bridge right behind us. Just a beautiful, beautiful day. It's one of the reasons that I love to go fishing, the whole travel adventure thing. And today was an awesome day. Standing next to me is the owner operator of the Sea Wolf, John. Hey, John, thanks for having us out today, man. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Anything you want to tell our viewers? No, all I got to say is to catch fish, you got to be out here. For the guys that our internet fishermen look at the, look at the paper or sit on the sofa yeah, sit on the sofa waiting for the perfect day yeah. the perfect day is when you're out here yeah so. and if you would have looked at the weather report for monday it was 30 knot winds 15 foot seas today sunday beautiful we had two foot swell five knot winds we flew the drone today we saw whales and we get to end the day going underneath the golden gate bridge just a beautiful beautiful view it's just lots of fun if you guys want more information about the sea wolf how can they find you john either at fish emeryville on the web at fish emeryville.com or seawolfsportfishing.com yeah. or you can give the bait shop a call um, at fish emeryville and he's also on facebook he's always posting up pictures and stuff there so come fish with him and then the next day go out with his brother on the new hug fin but john runs a great operation come fish with them up here really recommend it and on the tv show i can't say stuff like that like what boats i recommend and which trips are worth it but on these video blogs i want you guys to know the truth this is one of the great operations up here you won't be disappointed the guys are up here every day on the water they're going to take care of you don't worry if you're like a Southern California person and you don't have all the right tackle. John and his crew have the tackle on the board. For the rods and reels, any of the rods and reels that you have at home that you fish 25 to 40 on will work up here. You don't have to have special gear. I use the same gear today that I use at Catalina, San Clemente Island, or even fishing off Long Beach. It's pretty simple, huh? Yeah, yeah. We fish anywhere from black bass gear up to like a 670 light. Yeah, we did a lot of light gear today. A lot of Spectra with um, like mono leader on top of it, 30, 40 pound leader, even used 25 pound today. And because we're fishing down deep all the time, over hundred feet, you don't need any fluorocarbons, really basic gear. Don't be afraid to ask John questions on his Facebook page. We'd be glad to get you all set up. And coming up really soon is your crab season. Yeah, November, first Saturday in November till New Year's Eve, we fish, uh the Farallon Islands, weather permitting, and then pull our crab gear. And it's been pretty good fishing. Pretty good for the past five years. So Yeah, if you can't get on John's boat, call Emeryville Sport Fishing and they'll have some other boats you can probably get on. But you want to try to get on this boat, you won't be disappointed. But thanks for having us out, John. Right. You're welcome. That's today's video blog from Emeryville and at the Golden Gate Bridge. Thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe right here to my YouTube channel. I'll talk to y'all again really soon.